Benjamin West was an American working as history painter to England's King George III during the Revolutionary War. Of the dozens of royal commissions, West was to create a special series of paintings to decorate a chapel at Windsor Castle, and this tender, graceful work is one of them. Isaiah lived in Judah in the 8th century BC during the reign of four different kings, Uzziah, Jotham, Ahaz, and Hezekiah. As a prophet, he recorded the word that the Lord revealed to him, a word that included both judgment for forgetting God and hope in God's surprising plan of grace. He wrote not only to his contemporaries, but his prophecies also ministered to the nation in exile in the 6th century and to people of all times that hold fast to God's promises. In this painting, Isaiah is seated, preparing to write his message on a scroll, when he receives a vision into the throne room of God, the King and Lord of hosts. Immediately, Isaiah recognizes his personal unworthiness and the sinfulness of his nation. So a six-winged seraphim, although West depicts an angel, is sent to cleanse Isaiah's lips with a coal of fire. Isaiah's book is one of the longest Old Testament volumes, but it is also one of the richest, giving insight into the suffering Messiah and his redemption offered to both Jews and Gentiles.